Football Fans in Training is a men's health project run by the Scottish Premier League Trust and is aimed at men aged 35 to 65 who would like to adopt a healthier lifestyle. The fans join their SPL club, their coach and good eating and drinking habits as well as raising their exercise levels. This week I'm with the buddies of Paisley and we're talking about alcohol. As we've said throughout the whole programme, not to cut it out entirely because Drinking alcohol can be enjoyable within its limits, so my message to the guys tonight would be don't cut it completely out of your diary, but you know, have a serious think about what you are drinking uh, and the amounts. Result? <sighs> guys, just some interesting facts um, about calories contained in beer. Standard pint, 165 calories. Cider, 193. Lager standards, 187 calories in one pint. That bottle of wine, for example, almost 600 calories, um, which is quite a lot. That, that there, one shot, Right, but 61 to 64 calories in that uh, pure raw alcohol. If you take in 500 calories each day more than you need, you will gain one pound in weight a week. Fair enough. Some great advice on the amount of calories involved in alcohol. But the real danger comes when after a few of these, your inhibitions go and you go from having a couple of pints to half the fridge or a wee bag of crisps. These are for the cameraman. And I'm not the only one that struggles with crisps. You will fall. Everybody does it. And you have to stop beating yourself up about it. Because at the end of the day, there isn't anything rigid. And it goes into a wee bit of mindset. You know, you can recover. Does it take just a wee bit extra walking to shake off what you've done wrong? Remember, don't punish yourself. It's not, that's not what it's intended to do. It took me half an hour to open a packet of hula hoops last night. Yeah, and I bet you were. Well, I had them in and out of the cupboard. <laughs> I bet you. <laughs> <laughs> Could you not? In and out of the cupboard Did half a dozen times. Aye. Aye. You're a disaster. When you build up your strength and get them open quicker. <laughs> you're bringing it to shit. Well, I'm sure, I'm sure headline news in BBC Scotland tomorrow night will be Stuart. As a four hour dance with the hula hoops <laughs> <laughs> in his kitchen Not in the and, and actually ends up eating them. Before the lads head out for their exercise, there's a surprise visit from St Mirren manager Danny Lennon. Hello gentlemen. Nice to see you. How are we? Right. Right, this is about alcohol. How come there's no drinks on the table? Drinks over here, Gaffer. We've kept it out the road. We knew you were coming, so we've tried to. Right, give us some interesting facts, you know. Yeah. The, the guys, Gary and, and Brian and Stevie, the community guys at the heart of the club, they do an absolutely terrific job, and you know they've got a wide variety of things going on there. And I remember the first uh, fit club that they'd actually put on, and I come up and done a bit of chat, and a great interaction again with the supporters, and went into some some lifestyle change things, and and things that we do actually as professional sports people, you know, and it's just trying to get them to relate that, you know, sometimes you've got to sacrifice things that you love, you know, to, to make sure that, you know, you're, you're, you're in well top condition, good health first and foremost, and, you know, even just being healthy, it just makes a, a, a full factory you feeling better, you know, so the programmes that they actually deliver here are fantastic. Be surprised at all about any of the things the guys are talking? Yeah, some of the, the things were quite interesting kind of thing. I mean, what about the, the amount of alcohol and beer? I mean, I, I must admit, I'm, that's my problem. I, I do like a pint. I'm the same. Kind of, that's, yeah. that's kind of a really... Didn't you know that, that many calories kind of hanging out? That, that yeah. sort of thing and these kind of things. Yeah, it's quite telling. And you seem to really enjoy your, your beer and your, your socialising. You don't realise how many calories he's got into it. Kind of thing. See the first. See when I got the sheet. The first thing I did was I went, how can I best get pissed with <laughs> as least calories as possible? You know, and you're a not wrong. A couple of bottles of wine is actually better for getting you pissed than six pints of beer. So all joking aside, I've walked to the pub. I've got a gym session tonight. It's Friday, so I'm due a pint. It'll be my last right enough because I'm also getting weighed. And you'll find out the results of that next week, along with me kicking a ball about Firth Park with the lads from Motherwell.